Maddie, we're going on a Euro trip. High five. Oh, good boy. What's going on, guys? As you may or may not know, I'm going to be traveling this summer, and I decided to do a little travel shopping haul and kind of a travel packing video, kind of showing you guys maybe some tips and tricks on how to make packing and traveling easier. What's going to make this difficult is I'm only bringing a carry-on suitcase and a backpack. So I want to get started show you guys some of the things I've got. I've been using this for a while now. It's the Herschel suitcase. Oh, there's uh, clothes in here. Hmm. Probably should have unpacked that. We've got to pack just this full of items. I think we can do it, right? Can we do it? Three weeks worth? That suitcase is great because it has like the swivel wheels so it's easy to maneuver. It's not like too difficult. And then I ordered online this backpack. It's the High Sierra Travel Backpack. Also has two wheels, nice. And this sneaky little zip so you can pull this up if you don't want it to be a backpack. Or you just toss it on your back and you're ready to go. It's actually not that heavy considering it has uh, wheels on it. So what I figured I was going to be doing for this trip since I'm only bringing these two things is instead of bringing a purse, I'm going to shove a smaller backpack inside my backpack so that while I'm out exploring, I can have all of my cameras, my important things in here, super lightweight, flexible, because carrying a purse is too much work. Inside of the other travel backpack, I ordered a pillow, which we can simply, Maddie, why are you so interested in all these things? Is it because they all smell so new? There were some pillows that were inflatable, but I was like, I don't see how that would make much sense. Oh, do you not work? Don't tell me you don't work. I just purchased you. So this has a clip, so I can just clip it onto my backpack and we can basically just toss it. What the hell? So I can strap this onto the backpack, if not putting it inside it, so I won't lose it. I guess we could probably take a better look inside the backpack. It has these two little compartments. None of this video is sponsored either. This is just me, hopefully, purchasing the right products to travel. It's got these big compartments in there, which is nice. Has another big compartment. Oh, and then another compartment. Oh, this is the big boy compartment. This is the one that matters, to me at least. I needed something that could also hold my computer, so it has a little computer padded pouch and a decent amount of space in there. I think this backpack was a great, great, great investment. It's almost as big as my suitcase. The next thing that I want to show you guys for traveling, I've had these forever. They're my Bose headphones. These are like the sport ones, I think. These are a couple years old. These are my absolute favorite. I lost the adapter though, so they're super short. I wanted to pack my noise canceling headphones, but I only have the over the ear ones and I don't need more things. Okay, what else did I get today? I went to Target, that was wild. So the next thing you guys have probably probably seen me wear these a million times in pictures and videos, but these are my folding Ray-Ban glasses. I have been obsessed with these forever. So they fold up into just a tiny, tiny, tiny little thing. I ended up buying a new pair of sunnies. I thought they looked great with my hair and my skin tone. Look at that, fly. Or do I look stupid? I don't know, I can't see. All right, onto the more practical things. What did I get at Target today? So this was in the travel section. start. It already broke. <laughs> That's okay. I actually didn't get the bag for that anyway. Why I bought this little travel bag, if you don't break it, it's got these great things inside. So you can put some spray stuff in here. You can put shampoo, conditioner in here. You can also put maybe like a lotion in here or anything you want. Toothbrush cover. I was gonna use this bag, but I broke it. Another traveling must. Wet ones. Well, I'm gonna want to like scrub my body. Just a little scrub until I can shower. I got these for a present for Justine. This has nothing to do with this video. Let me give you guys a secret of cheating the system. This is a sports bra. Small, <laughs> yeah, you can make jokes, it's okay. These are my absolute, absolute favorite, favorite sports bras. So they have like a little bit of padding in them. So they're comfortable, they've got a little bit of padding, give you a little bit of shape. I don't really wear real bras anymore unless I have to. So I also found at Target this travel bag for my camera. It is a low pro, I have no idea. I probably could have gotten a better one somewhere, but I ran out of time. Hopefully this fits my new camera. It doesn't fit. It fits! I'd probably take the lens off, but in case I'm in a hurry and I don't wanna take the lens off, it fits. All right, what else do we got? The Essential Mini Hairspray. So tiny. <gasps> the most important thing you can ever have while traveling. Socks. All black, all the same. So basically, it doesn't matter. They don't have to match because they're all gonna match anyway. What do we think? Do we like these? Do we like these? Socks are his favorite thing to chew up. 
Okay, we can't do that. This is teaching bad habits. We've got a little baby emergency band-aids, a little baby sunscreen, always gotta be prepared. The most important, emergency Advil. I am obsessed with Q-tips. I'm obsessed with cleaning my ears. I know it's bad, but if someone's like, Jenna, you can bring five things with you, what would it bring? I would say chapstick, Q-tips, more chapstick, more Q-tips, and a water. Speaking of, my absolute favorite chapstick ever. The Yes Chew. I like the coconut, but they were out of it. Oh, you're eating this? This is what I got for your mom. I got her this as a present. You can't eat her present. Yes Chew chapstick, it's the best. What is wrong with this dog? Another simple life hack for traveling. Dry shampoo. You don't have time to shower, you can't wash your hair. Dry shampoo. Now the hardest part of traveling, um, I mean, I don't wear a lot of makeup anyway. Here is my original travel makeup kit. Here is my new travel makeup kit. Look how tiny it is, it's so small. I actually got this at Nordstrom Rack for like 10 bucks. What a steal. I have a GoPro in my makeup bag. Wow. I've discovered that from Sephora, you know, if you guys shop at Sephora, you know how it's like, oh, you have points, you can use your points on whatever. So I actually would use my points and I would get these tiny, tiny little samples. So this is um, a Bay Breeze, it's like a hydrating shot for your hair. I have a big bottle of this, but now I have a small one that I could take with me. Same with this, I got this also as like a sample from Sephora. Uh, it's a makeup dissolver, face cleanser. It's perfect because look how small it is. Okay, what else we got for travel? Nothing too, too crazy. Travel toothbrush, it folds up, genius. This actually is something you guys could be into. These are travel tide sink packets. So in this little thing, there's three of them. So basically you can do your laundry in your sink. Very, very smart. I have been searching for a perfect pair of all black shoes and I finally found them. These are the Nike Freeze. Justine was like, yeah, it looks like you're wearing orthopedic shoes. But guess what, Justine? Shut up, because I'm gonna be comfortable. I'm only gonna be packing one shoe. This is the shoe that I'm gonna be wearing all the time. So I figured, hey, might as well get all black so it won't be showing dirt. They're comfortable, I know I like them. Maybe they are white orthopedic shoes. I'm gonna be walking all over Europe. Also a travel hack that I've realized is super, super easy, shoving things inside the shoe. This in here, I can put this in here. I can put this in here. I can shove so many things in my shoe. Let me show you guys about my favorite pair of Lulu pants. I'm already wearing them. All I'm gonna be wearing, and they have pockets in the side. So right here, this is a pocket. So say I wanna put my sunglasses in there. I can do it. They have a zipper in the back. You can put keys, important things, credit card, money, another pocket on the side. Because if I'm gonna be traveling, I wanna have things on my body at all times. So two extra pockets, an extra zipper, and a secret little pocket here. It's just super helpful. Highly recommend those pants. Cotton On has these incredible lightweight t-shirts. Look at this, a nice lightweight shirt. I think it was like two for 20 bucks, so I got another one in gray. What is this? Oh, I got sweatpants. Cool. I've got another black shirt. Can you guys see a, a theme here of what I'm gonna be wearing in Europe? <laughs> this is another just Lululemon tank top. I'll be wearing this a lot, another Lulu tank. And lastly, the same Lulu tank, but in a different color. The goal of how am I gonna pack all of these things? It's a great question, but I think I'll be fine. I'll give you guys an update of when I actually pack, if it all fits, but I figure I'm gonna pack for three or four days and just wash and rewear everything. Anyway guys, if you have any travel tips or tricks or any suggestions on traveling, let me know, leave it in the comments, let's help each other out. I also highly suggest downloading a bunch of like travel apps beforehand or having any documents that you need for when you get there, like have them ready and available offline. So if you get there, you're like, I don't have service, what do I do? Have a screenshot of it, have something ready. Currency converting apps, you don't wanna be like, how did I just spend this amount of money when I thought it was this amount of money. So have all the apps and stuff ready for when you get there so that you can hopefully use them offline. You just gotta be prepared. Am I prepared? I am not. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you. Get ready for a ton, a ton, a ton of travel videos coming soon. Have a great day. I love you.